Hi friends, welcome to Durga Soft. Sir, in this video, I want to explain how to write and run Python program in Linux, in Linux operating system, sir. Do you know, most of it's very common doubt for most of the people. Usually in our offline sessions, our Python programs, we are always going to explain in the Windows environment, right? Sir, some students are, are a bit, a bit, uh, very, very uh, uh, interested saying, Sir, I want to execute my Python program in Linux, in Ubuntu. Can you please guide? Like, uh, this is a very common question from most of the students. Sir, now I will explain how we can do that. It is a very, very easy thing, sir. So, the first thing what you should aware, okay, with the Ubuntu or with the Linux, sir, Python software, will come automatically, okay? Python, Python is available with a, with a Linux, Linux flavor, any, any flavor of Linux, Python by default available, we are not required to install separately, good news, okay? Next, uh, how you can do that? So, while writing Python program, to run Python program, what things we have to take care? Just uh, observe it carefully, sir. Here, already I am in the Ubuntu, just uh, let me open my terminal, sir. Okay. Now I am in. Okay. Just observe. Observe carefully. I am in my home directory. Slash home slash Dubasaf is my home directory. Then what I want to take here is I want to write one script. Okay. So usually recommended to write the scripts uh, in separate folder. They will be the scripts are any folder. Don't write the script in the home directory. Then sir, CD. There is one folder is there, scripts folder is there, okay, in this scripts director is there, in this. So, there are multiple scripts are available, right, okay, multiple, multiple things are there. Forget about this, I want to create my own, my own script, okay, how you can do that, sir. So, if you want to write the, write the, any, any Python program, okay, any, any program, first you require to create the script, script, any script, sir. So, there are multiple ways are there to create file in, in Linux, sir. So, by using touch command to create an empty file. Remember this one, sir. To create an empty file, touch command. Cat command can be used uh, to create uh, a file with uh, some content. Or you can use editors also, like uh, G editor, G editor, nano editor, VI editor, or pin editor, like that. Uh, multiple editors are there. But easiest thing, just uh, let me use G edit, okay? Here I'm taking G edit, G, G edit, uh, here I'm taking. So G edit, name of my Python script here, test.py. I'm taking, sir. Sir, now our notepad is going to is going to open. Test.py notepad itself is going to be open, sir. Sir, here you have to write the your Python code. Okay, just my requirement name is equal to. Okay, let me take here. Let me let me write the, here in the edit plus and then I will do copy paste. Don't worry, sir. Here name is equal to input of input of. Enter, enter name, enter name. Are can you please enter your name? Okay, like that. I have one list is there. I want to create one list. List of heroines, like assume that, sir. Okay, here something like Katrina I'm taking. Next time after that, Karina I'm taking. Okay, next time, okay, Malika something like I'm taking. Next time after that, Sunny, like this I'm taking, sir. That's all. This is a list, a list of four names you are taking. Okay, sir. So now my requirement is, observe very carefully, right? I want to already, I read the name, name, name of the end user. Now, print the, print the, hello, hello, name, okay, hello, 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 just I'm trying to take, here just the hello, come on, name, so maybe hello, Druga or something like that, print the, print the, uh, congratulations, okay, uh, congratulations, congratulations, you are going to marry, congratulations, you are going to, you are going to marry, marry, like that. Uh, from this list of names, uh, some random name I want to select. How you can get a random object uh, from the list? Uh, there is a random module is there, uh, which contain choice function, okay? Random dot choice function I'm taking, of uh, L I have to take. That 
that's all so but anyway yes i am using a random function compulsory report to import import random function are getting what is the what is the function we report to take it sir can you please import random 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 function okay i come taking that's all this is my code sir sir now i want to run i want to run this code in in python environment okay what i am taking sir already gedit i did sir let me take this the same code just i copy pasted for readable this say okay that's all now python code is ready test dot py okay like right? let me let me close let me close this file okay python file is ready sir okay like right? now my my requirement here is just observe carefully here just the cat can okay what is the file name i took sir test dot py right? okay this is my code import random name is equal to like this i am i'm taking sir sir now to run any script it may be shell script it may be java program it may be python program compulsory this script should have execute permissions so the person who is going to execute you should have execute permissions on the script so l yes i from l l as i from l so for this do you know this is the this is the long listing of my file here just uh, observe a bit very very carefully about this terminal here right? so you know this uh, first character specifies represent type of the file i for means a normal file okay normal text file next uh, here do you know these things are permissions permissions right okay the first three are owner permissions next three are group permissions next the three are other others permissions right so owner having read and write but not execute permission next the group members having only read permission only read permission but not write and execute next the others having only read permission but not write and execute remember right so i want to provide execute permission for everyone to run this script what is the way yes sir here this is the command query what you ch mod sir change mod can be used to change permissions of the file remember right so a plus x i'm taking so a plus x test dot py and then is ch mod a plus x test dot py so for test dot py file for a a means everyone for all it may be owner or it may be group member it may be other please give execute permission like like i'm taking sir of course there are multiple other ways also there but this is one way sir don't worry here let me execute this one okay ch mod can you please tell what is the what the what the option i have to take a plus x a means for all give execute permission for which files are tested dot py okay like right? now let me crack check ls i from l test dot py now observe this one now take very special care sir now you can see execute permission now you can see execute permission okay like uh, for every person here uh, read write execute for the owner next and after that for the group member read and execute next and after that for others read and execute now execute permissions are there okay fine so next thing what i have to take here is i have to run i have to run this python script so we have to use python command in the windows operating system we are always going to use okay python python test dot py okay python test dot py or sometimes uh, py test dot py okay like but in ubuntu which command is there in my current version i don't know that's why so what we can take so let me take which py okay in the py is a valid command or not let me check py is valid command or not nobody is telling a uh, py not found remember this one sir py not found so it is not next uh, sir if i can take python is it going to work or not yes command python not found not found okay like so sudo apt install python 3 python python minimal something like it's exhausting sir now do you know let me check uh, python 3 is available or not 
which is Python 3. Okay, is it available or not? Yes, friend. Have you observed? Have you observed? Python 3 is already there. So, where this command is available? Slash user slash bin. Okay, in that Python 3 is available. Now, run your script by using Python 3 command. Remember this one, sir. So, what is the way? Python 3, Python 3, test.py, happily this code to run, sir. Now, observe carefully. Python 3, Python, Python 3, okay, test.py. I got to take Python 3, test.py, sir. Here in the current working directory, test.py file is there. Can you please run that test.py file? Like, like I'm trying to take. Now, enter name. Enter name. Yes, the Durga, I'm trying to enter. Enter name, Durga. Now, hello, Durga. Congratulations. You are going to marry Karina. <laughs> you are going to marry Karina, something like that. Sir, let me run again. So, enter the name. Okay, now I'm trying to enter Shiva. Okay, hello, Shiva. Congratulations. You are going to marry Karina. Are you pretending this book? Providing Karina, Karina, like let me crack it, sir. Sir, here something like Pavan I'm taking. Now, this time, have you observed like Katrina? Okay, so some random name will be selected from our list. Okay, let me run again. Let me run again. Okay, here just uh, uh, I'm taking Durga again. Now, observe this one. So, you are going to marry Sunny. Okay, like uh, so just uh, take very special care how you can run. So, how you can write the Python script and how you can run the Python script in the Ubuntu area. But uh, before run any script, uh, compulsory we have to provide execute permissions. There are multiple ways are there to provide execute permission. This is uh, one way, simple way uh, for all users. Can you please give execute permission? Now, by using which command Python 3 test.py in your system, Python may be available or py command may work. Can you please cross check, sir? Next, uh, I have one more small important point I have to tell you. Okay, I hope you people may be aware. Shabang. Shabang. Okay, don't tell you it's not moving in. <laughs> okay, Shabang. Shabang. Uh, some people may write uh, in this style also. Shabang. Are you getting Some people may write in this style also. Shabang. What is this Shabang? In the Linux area, Unix area, scripting area, this is the most important thing, sir. What it means, sir? Sir, you know, Ash symbol is there. I hope it's a, it's a very familiar, the most popular programming language, C sharp. Are you getting C sharp? C sharp is there. So now this symbol is, is known as Ash symbol or, or sharp, sharp symbol. Okay, remember this one, C sharp. Okay, so this, uh, this is known as yeah, sharp symbol. Okay, what is this one, sir? This, is the, this symbol is known as sharp, sharp symbol, right? Next, uh, sir, exclamation mark. This symbol is also known as bang symbol. Remember this one, uh, bang, bang symbol, right? This symbol is also known as bang, bang symbol, right? Now, if I combine the both, okay, can you please uh, read? Uh, if I combine the both, uh, what is the answer we have? Uh, sharp bang. Okay, sharp bang. Some people may use, uh, okay, sharp bang, shabang, or some people may use, uh, you know, she bang, something like that. So, in Linux or Linux area, she bang means uh, this is the thing. Okay, I hope it's clear. Now, where we are going to use this shabang, sir? It's a very, very simple. In your script, uh, at the top, if you can write the shabang, Okay, here just a shabang. What it means is, are you, can you please execute my script with the which command you can specify there only. In the script itself you can specify, okay, like how you can, just observe this one. Here, which python 3 we record it use. Which python 3? Sir, here, slash user, slash bin, slash python 3, we record user, right? Slash user, slash bin, slash python 3, we record, we record user. Now, observe that, you have to specify. If you specify shabang in any script, now this script should be interpreted by, okay, this command, this, this command, okay, like this script can be executed by this command. At the time of executing the script, you are not required to use the command because already you provided that information in the script itself, okay? Remember, now have a look once, sir. 
what i call to take here let me open let me open my script again g alien test the dot w i am taking <clears throat> okay now at the top let me add that can you please confirm i forgot the syntax what is that yash symbol and then exclamation mark this thing is by default considered as what shabang shabang now what i have to take here is slash user slash bin slash python 3 remember this one sir let me cross check is it correct or not slash user slash bin slash python 3 okay like i specify that's all if you use this one now this script will be executed by will be executed by this python 3 itself we are not required we are not required to use command at the time of execution let me save let me save and then let me close this file okay like uh, now so is it reflected or not cat test dot py i am taking i am trying to open this dot py by using cat command yes this is already there are you getting this is already there now this script will be executed by python 3 already permissions are there i provided right now directly okay directly dot ash sir test dot py now i'm trying to execute directly sir have a look one sir now i'm trying to execute directly i'm not using python 3 command because i provided command information by using shabang in the python script now observe and the name durga and the name durga hello durga congratulations you are going to marry mallika something like that. so here just the pavan i'm trying to take hello pavan you are uh, you are going to marry katrina something like that. are you in the position to understand right so how you can write the python script next how you can run by using python 3 command or python command next if you provide shabang what is the advantage we are going to get next why the word shabang what is the speciality of shabang like it is the very clear for you people right yes friends any doubt about this terminology if you are having any doubt if you are expecting anything please yeah in the comment so that i will do the required video okay thanks for all now you are not having any doubt how you can write python code in ubuntu or in linux environment how you can run okay right? what is the biggest advantage speciality with the linux uh, by default python is available we are not required to install separately okay thanks man